Let's begin with the design. The phone is a tad lighter than the previous version. Interestingly, its new hinge folds flat. As the company says, it's the thinnest foldable phone yet. But let's not forget, it's still thicker than a regular phone and also more fragile. I quite like its screen. It's brighter than its predecessor and produces true to life colors. Talking about the camera, its imaging setup is good. It generates excellent results. The camera performance won't let you down. But I think a flagship phone like this that costs $1,800 could have been engineered with a better camera. The phone that doubles up as a tablet offers great multitasking abilities. The Fold 5 gives users faster access to recent apps. I must say, having used it for some time, I have no complaints regarding its performance. It packs a powerful battery which easily lasts for a day even with heavy use. Overall, the phone turns out to be a good contender in the foldable phone market. But I would like to point out that the fifth generation Galaxy Z Fold is still expensive. We wish it was priced a bit lower.